So I was even trying some, if you remember back in like 2013, there was a big course on Amazon Kindle publishing where you, you know, get somebody to write you a book, you publish it, you, you know, do something to promote it. And, uh, and, uh, you know, I burned a couple hundred bucks there before giving up, uh, got back into the kind of the, uh, the college stage. I was thinking I was going to be a consultant, do an MBA, this and that. And then boom, I saw a course from the guy, um, who I'm not going to name, but he kind of got me back in the game. And, uh, just the fact that I paid, I got into credit card debt. I was kind of, you know, okay, I have this much time to succeed. And the fact that I did kind of, uh, propelled me to be able to, you know, be in this entrepreneurship game since college and never actually really having a job. And that's interesting because that's that kind of mirrors something that our guest from last week said, Leanne, when she was on the show was, um, she set out to, to create her own business and she very definitely put in place a, a timeline of events. Like, I've got this long and I must make it work within this time frame. Otherwise I'm going to have to go and find something else to do because this just doesn't work. So maybe that's something that we all kind of have in common is that, you know, even at that young age, there's got to be that focal point. There's got to be that, that turning point where actually, do you know what, I've given this as much as I can. Is that, is that, does that kind of resonate with you? Is that where you went with it? 